Hey, what's going on everyone? If you like my content, please click on that thumbs up button and give this video a like. And if you're new to my channel, feel free to subscribe. Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Big Hunter channel. My name is Hunter and on this video, we'll be taking a look at the clan of cave Batman. And also I'll be giving you an explanation on this particular minifigure. As always, we'll just do a quick review and uh, the field guide on this guy is of course the Batman cowl. If you feel the Batman cowl out of the 20 minifigures is one of six Batman. And then if you have to fill the caveman club here, then you know you have clan of Batman. And it should be pretty easy. Now, this minifigure basically has the works. I mean, it has everything. It has dual molded legs, dual molded arm, side leg printing, side arm printing. It even has printing on the cowl here. Only thing it doesn't have is back printing. And let me show you on the back here. Yeah, no printing on the back, but as you can see, it is dual molded legs and some awesome printing on the side. And of course, the printed legs on the side. And sorry for the glare, but as you can probably see, there is printing on the cowl there to show like stitches and stuff. And the head has unique printing as well. Um, see the lines on the side of the face there and that bandana that goes across is usually we see it in black or white but in this particular case it is actually brown so that's kind of new and on with the explanation of this character now the explanation of this character is more has to do with the name itself because for all intent purposes we could just call this minifigure Caveman Batman but LEGO decided to name this minifigure Clan of Cave Batman and what they're referencing is an old 1980s book by Jin and Owl and the book is called Clan of Cave Bear they actually even made a movie out of it but basically the movie tells a story of historical fictional novel and Jin M. I was actually known to write series of books like that, like uh, like you know novels and stories, historic times, I mean prehistoric times. And in this particular book, Clan of Cave of Bears, uh, it tells a story of a young human girl, and as I mentioned, it takes place in prehistoric times. And the story starts out in the book that she loses her family and she's pretty much lost on her, on her own and she comes across a group of Neanderthals that call themselves the clan and of course they live in caves hence clan of cave but in any case so yeah she finds herself uh, with the group of Neanderthals and she end up living with the uh, group of Neanderthals and at the tours and, and you know it's, it's, a, it's a book it's a story so things happen yada 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 and uh, at the end of the book she basically gets banished and, and she goes off on her own she's a grown woman and uh, she goes off to find humans like herself to live with but anyway that's the story and uh, that's what Lego is referencing when they named this Batman clan of cave Batman so instead of clan of cave bear which the book was called they're calling this clan of cave Batman and I'm thinking at the in the marketing department that was naming the minifigures Maybe there was someone there who was a fan of this particular book, Clan of K-Bears. But anyways, there's my explanation. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And if you're new to my channel, and if you enjoyed this content, feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching. This is Brick Country signing out. And see you on the next video. Bye.